Okay, so today is April 16th, 2020, and for today's Name That Species, I'm again here uh, at the back of Billy's old trailer, and the reason I'm here is obviously to talk to you more about the whole Floyd Squatch thing that we uh, are investigating right now. Um, if I aim the camera over to trail camera you'll see that the broth can is still there and still mostly untouched uh, so I'm gonna go ahead and walk on over and grab the SD card and check it out um, like I've been saying this has been the main thing on my mind these past couple of days I am working on uh, more SciFacts videos and video lessons and other things though, so uh, I apologize for not releasing as many other kinds of videos, um, but this has been the main thing I have been focusing on. One thing I wanted to mention too, uh, this morning I was doing some reading, and still here so I'm glad, the lichen over here is what I'm uh, going to talk about again. Um, I was doing some reading this morning about is it in my shot about uh, purported Sasquatch behaviors and one of the behaviors that I was reading about was called gifting and as the name suggests it refers to the creature leaving behind gifts uh, for people to find in a place that a Sasquatch has been so um the lichen we found here from yesterday, and like I said, I'm glad it's still here. Um, when I first saw this, I assumed it just fell from a tree, and you know that's a pretty good guess as to what happened. But you know, maybe uh, maybe it was a gift from the creature. So uh, I really don't know. But uh, because uh, this was here, it got me thinking that maybe the uh, the broth can which we have over there isn't a good enough gift, if you will, I mean, I, I put it out as bait, but maybe it's not a good enough gift for uh, the creature to come uh, and grab. So I'm going to leave today a hard-boiled egg. Uh, I made this just for this purpose, uh, and I'm going to leave this, I guess, on the rock um, by the broth. Maybe I'll put it over here more. Okay. And I'll bring the lichen in, in as well. I'll let them know. And maybe this will be a uh, a better thing to leave behind to try to get him to show himself again. So, uh, let me get a good thumbnail with the egg. And let's go ahead and grab that SD card and see if we record anything good for today. All right, so I'm going to go check this out, and I will be back. All right, so I just came back from checking the SD card from last night and only one clip was recorded, and I didn't see any activity. Um, I think it was just the wind that set it off, but I'll, I'll include it in the video, and I'll let you be the judge of that. So I'm gonna go and put the SD card back in the trail cam, which we see over here with the egg. One thing I did notice, though, I noticed this uh, while walking back up from the trail camera, this tree right over here to the uh, left of Floyd's Creek, 
Um, okay, so here's Floyd's Creek. And here is this tree. I notice over here on what would be approximately the north side of the tree. I got some moss over there to give me a confirmation on that. This thing right here appears to be a small collection of fibers, possibly hair. You can see the kind of the colorations. We'll hold it out in the sun a little bit. Um, you know, could have been left by anything. Could have been a bird. Uh, interesting colors, though, on the uh, fur. This would be good for tying flies, actually. Um, because I've seen a handful of flies that have this color. So I thought that was kind of interesting. I'm going to leave this back where I found it. Get a quick picture with it. Possible Floyd squat chair, who knows? Um, yeah, it's always good to find something, right? So yeah, I guess Fort Say's name, name that species. You could uh, try your best at identifying what these hairs came from, if they are hairs. I mean, I kind of think that's it's mainly grass. Uh, but this colored part here catches my eye. Right there, those fibers. You see the black and the the tan color there. So, uh... We'll put those back in. Maybe I should collect these, collect these as a sample, though. I might do that, actually. So maybe on the way back, I'll, uh... hold on to these and bring them back in as possible Floyd Squatch. Hairs. So you know what? I'm just gonna bring them with me. Okay. Uh, I do have to go and put the SD card back in, though. So yeah. Um, tonight is gonna be night number three of using the trail camera to try to get some Floyd Squatch footage. Um, let me go ahead and put the SD card back in. The gifting. I am interested to see if that will make any kind of difference. Let's see uh, if Squatch is interested in a hard boiled egg. Alright, so, uh, until tomorrow. But for today, I hope you enjoyed this Name That Species. And maybe, you know, you can uh, go ahead and take a look at these hairs here and see if you can identify what species this is. One thing I wanted to mention, too, again with the lichen. Remember, I've, I was talking about lichens. And that was the species on the on name that species two days ago. So it is kind of weird that is the one that ends up here. I mean, yeah, I could have just fell, but hey, I mean, everything's worth noting at this point. So uh, there you go. Today on name that species.